Today I'm going to be revealing five unsaturated $100,000 winning products for you. Let's go. Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. My name is Ricky Hayes. Don't forget to enter the competition below for a 30 minute call with myself to do so. Like the video, comment, crush it down below, subscribe and share with friends and family. Without further ado, anyway, let's get straight into today's video on these five unsaturated $100,000 products for you. So the first is the Pet Flea Comb. This is a trending product that's trending up right now. I'll open up that link in a moment. I just wanted to explain why it's a winning product. It helps to kill and remove fleas from dogs. Okay, so it's a simple comb that allows fleas to be removed, killed and removed from dogs. It has mass appeal. The first thing I saw when I seen this product is that it has mass appeal, okay? Um, as everyone has cats or dogs. So it's not just for dogs, it's more centered towards dogs, but it can obviously work somewhat with cats as well. So, but mainly market it towards dogs. People care, deeply care for their pets, so their family, okay? So uh, this is an item that a lot of people will go out and actually they'll buy because they care so much for their dog. And obviously they just don't want fleas and that inside their, their house anyway. The item, uh, I love how these types of items are so easy to ship. And people will likely buy multiple of them uh, as they have multiple pets and they just don't want to cross contaminate and stuff like that. Okay, so um, that's that's my justification. How I found this item is I just use Sales Source. Okay, there's a link in the description below. I just find all of these from Sales Source really easy. Um, I like the margins. Um, so uh, you can easily sell it for 25 bucks or 24.99. It costs about eight dollars USD. If you use a private supply, you usually get about another 20 to 30 percent off that. So you can probably get this for privately about five, six bucks, and really heavily brand it. Um, so that includes shipping. Again, easy to ship. So it's a really easy item to ship to customers. I absolutely love that. Um, one of the big things is you can really scale this type of item really big. Okay, it's not an item that's country specific. It's an item that is. You know, there's do dogs and cats all across the world. So I'd be marketing this to top tier countries. So um, if this is saturated in the US, I would also try Canada, UK, Australia, and New Zealand. And if that does well, I then try the other three countries, primarily Italy, Germany, and France. They have good GDP. Um, so I always have recommendation, um, make a unique video on it. If you haven't done so already, I recommend checking out how to make uh, high converting seven figure videos. There's a couple of videos ago, it'll be a link in the card. Just have a look at that now. Um, and market it to the US again, as I've said. Um, I highly recommend that you would brand this. It is an item that's probably gonna go viral really quick. It'll probably really, really, really blow up. You really wanna brand this as your own um, if you really wanna try and hammer home that product as the most for you. So who are you gonna market it to? Uh, women, 25. Um, men would buy this item, but it will again primarily be women. I always start with with women, generally because they're the ones, in most instances, that will do the the most amount of buying in the e-commerce space. I, I just target dog ma magazines, dog documentaries, like just animal documentaries, maybe as well. Uh, famous uh, famous dogs, dog brands. I don't know, like Whiskers or um, uh, Petco. Um, pet barn, all of those, uh, dog food brands, tons of those out there as well, and just generally people that love dogs, because people that love dogs most of the time generally have a dog. I, I love dogs myself, and I have a dog, so um, logically that makes sense. Let's have a look at the link. So this is it here, all right? So this is the, the product, um, five bucks 85 plus, I think it was like, it was about two bucks e packet or something like that. So, um, really, really easy. I love how it's just got one variant, right? Simple, simple and easy. It's got really good reviews. We can see already hundreds of orders. Um, so I go off by a number of orders, but I don't do thousands of orders. Uh, well, I can, but um, we're trying to find unsaturated products. And this might might be the only supplier. Um, we if we scroll down, we're probably going to find a number of people. Uh, other suppliers also marketing this uh, exact item, it's always the way, go away. Um, all right, so we, yeah, we can see it down here as well. So I don't know why it's taking so long to load, but you've got high quality images as well. So if you wanna make a unique video, some of these images will really work well. Anything with a dog in it is really going to help. That is really good with you know killing the fleas. 
always try and look for a video. A lot of these AliExpress suppliers actually do supply videos now. So if you're after a video, just contact the supplier about that one. Moving on to the next item, um, the Magic Wardrobe Hanger. Okay, so this is a cool item as well. Um, again, found this just by Salesforce. Um, just logged in and, and just had a look at their um, hot trending products. Anyway, and um, it solves a problem by, so in a lot of people's wardrobes, they're pretty messy, um, unorganized and not tidy. All right, so what this is gonna do is it's, it's just a, a wardrobe hanger, but with a slight twist. Um, allows you to hang up multiple items and actually you can, it's like using one, um, one wardrobe hanger, but you're actually using five. So in theory you get five, I think it's five or six times the space. I'll show you the product in a moment. So it makes it very compact. All right, very compact. Um, as a result, people can obviously fit five times, five, six times the amount and they can categorize, you know, their the, the type of clothing, or whatever they have in their wardrobe. All right, it's really, really good for that. Um, so this is a low ticket item. So it is based on uh, quantity, all right? And you really want to try and increase your average order value. So I'd be selling this for 20 bucks. Um, as this is the lowest I go in marketing items, there is an exception to that that you'll see later in the video, but um, $19.99 because it's important when you're marketing to top tier countries, that you understand that a lot of the time, unless, unless you have a really untapped product, which these are untapped products, then yeah, your cost per purchase is usually around ten dollars. If you that's why I try and teach. If you can try and get these as the first, all right, your cost per purchase can be like three, four, five dollars, all right. But when it's saturated, that's when it starts hitting ten, fifteen, even twenty dollars, all right. So that's why we want to get in first. Make a video. Um, oh, I forgot to um, uh, who to sorry, but anyway, um, uh, make a video on a messy wardrobe. So if you can find a video on someone who likes messy wardrobe. Um, so start the, like how I picked, I'm trying to give you an idea on how you would make these creatives because the creatives are so very important. So, you know, you, you start with the product and, and what it does. See someone using the product, putting it in their wardrobe. Wow, this is amazing. And then you would go to, <clears throat> what I normally would do, I picture would be, I would go to a scene where it's a gray, if you can get this type of creative, a gray, gray screen. It's okay, so you can do that in Camtasia, just a gray overlay of uh, someone trying to put all their clothes in a messy wardrobe and put like a massive X over the top of it, you know, and because that's not what people want. We're showing what our product is, what they, what the problem they're facing is, and then we would say, introducing the magic wardrobe hanger. Um, having an un, um, uh, messy and non-tidy wardrobe is a thing of the past. And then just show how it works, right? So so that, that that's how you really want to market it. You always find that those are the ones that generally do best where it has the product, then it has like a gray screen with captions, with a crossover type thing, and then um, introducing our product and how it's gonna make everything better, you know, using making it all magical. And if I'm using the word magic wardrobe hanger, I'll try and make my video with magical audio, okay, and magical like just overlay, stuff like that, because the creative is what really makes the difference, okay? Buying this product, you can easily market it, but you need to make it creative that accommodates it it, it dramatically increases your chances of, of conversions. Um, so you'd market it to women again, 25 and 25 up, fashion magazines, Vogue, um, whatever the other ones are, I can't remember, um, fashion brands, famous models, famous actors, uh, you know, TV shows um, that are around, centered around fashion, um, centered around like, you know, here in Australia, farmer wants a wife. Ugh. Ugh. Anyway, but, um, Shows like that, you know, about romance, all of that, because romance, fashion, and all that is it's a good vibe. And so for me, I picture that that's how I would do it. Let's have a look at the actual product itself. <clears throat> so as you can see, this is what it is, okay? So it's like just literally like one hanger, but as a result, you can have multiple, all right? So um, you can actually use it, well, for clothing, but, um, but you can use it for towels. As I said, you've also, go away, um, you've also got... Um, uh, a video here that you can actually use. You've got tons of different images. See how very effective this is. All right, really easy to use, really easy um, to set up. It's literally like a dollar, all right? So a dollar and the shipping. I love it when you have products that the shipping's more expensive than the actual product. Um, obviously not marketing it to Australia right now, but it's about two, three dollars. 
um, to, to US. So we're talking about four bucks and sell it for 20 and you've got a nice margin. Again, I always try and aim at about a $15 margin and that fits within that, all right? So you can see you've got some images, unfortunately, with the annoying watermarks. But you get the idea of what this item does. Um, really, really, really powerful. It can actually do even more. Sorry, I missed this. It can do even more if you want. Um, really, really awesome idea that's going to save a lot of clutter and um, help a lot of people. We can also see it's got um, plenty of orders, not a huge amount. Again, I'm trying to teach you about unsaturated winning products. Um, makes it super easy because if you can find uh, an unsaturated product that has a massive, massive viral potential, then you, you're gonna get dramatically cheaper cost per purchase. All right, and this this the best part about this item that I, I forgot to mention. People will buy multiple of this. People could buy like I, I picture people would buy four or five of these. There are people that have lots of clothes, men as well, of course. Um, but you know, like lots of clothes, and and it could be used like for the bathroom and all of that. So bought four or five of these, and you could easily get your average order value from twenty to forty to fifty dollars with this type of item. It just is that type of item. All right, so keep that in mind. Let's move on to the next item. <clears throat> the beauty face mask. Now, this is an item that's trending up, so I really recommend trying to mark this one now. I have seen a few ads for it, but it isn't saturated as yet, hence why it is in this list of 100K products. <clears throat> um, fantastic item. It helps to remove fat from underneath an individual's chin or neck, whatever, um, using this product. It is a quantity purchase item. It's actually a very low ticket as it isn't reusable, so bulk orders will be a natural outcome, okay? So people will have to use these multiple times, like they're gonna have to use it every day type thing for a period of time to start to see the effects. So they're gonna have to buy uh, packets, packs of them, okay? Um, all right, and so uh, what, what I really like about it is it's not gonna have any health implications. Again, I don't normally go into items that are meant to instantly mend your skin and stuff because I don't know, I, unless I absolutely am confident with the product, I wouldn't. So um, it's not going to have any implications. It's basically just like some you know, rubber that's trying to help shape, shape your chin a bit more and your neck area. So it's not going to have any of that. So that's why I like this. Um, easy to install. Sorry, not easy to install. Easy to put on your face. I'm a bit of an IT nerd. It's self-explanatory, okay? But I would still recommend a video. Um, now, this is a low, low ticket item. I very rarely market these. I'd sell this for nine bucks, uh, 10 bucks, basically, um, because it, it is a very cheap item that people will buy multiple, okay? So your, your goal with this item is seriously to hammer home average order value, okay? Um, and you wanna get on it now before it gets too saturated. Otherwise, it'll probably become very hard to be profitable. So you really wanna try and sell packs, okay? Bundle packs and maybe some other item with it that can add another 10 bucks or something with it that really accommodates it quite well. Maybe another facial skin item that those are really trending right now. So that's why you wanna get on this as soon as possible. Uh, and again, it has high viral potential. So uh, women can have the perfect chin or whatever. I just put that there as a bit of humor, but basically it has high viral potential because um, it's an item that is very cheap, very, very cheap. It helps solve a problem easy for women to set up self-explanatory those are the types of elements you look for with a winning product and you want to jump on it straight away now as a rare exception as well i would actually market this to 18 plus i know i say never to 18 plus to start with but again because because it has such high viral potential and it's such a cheap item 10 bucks okay that they can actually afford that so they will actually buy these items and again women at that age um, obviously like men as well, but you know, for this type of product, they're very self-conscious of their appearance. Um, and so for a 10, 10, $20 purchase, it's within their budget. Um, and it's the type of item that they are likely to buy just because, um, they're very, um, uh, orientated towards their, their outward appearance. Anyway, so interests, um, would be, again, I would just choose makeup brands, famous models, fashion magazines, beauty TV shows, fashion brands. You can, you're starting to see a trend here between all my videos. I use a lot of the same interests, um, just as broad ones, because we're just giving goalposts, all right? So you don't need the perfect interest. We just need to make a good creative. So um, I've sort of already explained it there as well. But again, with this creative, you know, 
just like the last one, show the product, show what it does, show someone wearing it. Then again, show a gray screen with like a crossover or something of, you know, like of a saggy chin. And this could also work very well for older demographics that naturally get saggy skin and they'll buy more of it as well. Um, and uh, so, you know, show, don't get saggy skin, put this on and then have the perfect chin. Whatever. I'm pretty good at these. So let's have a look at the product anyway. Um, <clears throat> and me. So you can see this is it here, all right? So it's really easy for people to put it on. It's very flexible, so works toward works on any facial structure, um, any face size, etc., etc. We can see here, like it has not many reviews, but thousands of orders. Again, it's a dollar, okay? So the most expensive part of this product, again, is going to be the shipping, all right? But because... It <coughs> I mean, sorry, I still have a cold. Because it is um, an item that um, is such an easy item to ship, we can, yeah, two bucks. So we're looking at about three bucks, three bucks fifty. And again, most people are gonna buy, uh, you know, so you get one piece, okay? So people bundle it, three, four, five pieces, and people will spend $20, 30 There you go, you've got really good margins. Why does it always do this? Anyway. That's sales source, by the way. So that's what I do. Um, we can see here we got great images. Okay, I would actually, that is a thumbnail right there. All right, easy eyes, hell thumbnail. I would try and find some videos and off to the races. All right, so that is another fantastic item that I would recommend seriously looking into and getting on straight away. As I said, we've all seen that a lot of items that are trending right now are skin related items, skin, posture, all of those. Um, are very high trending items. So this fits well within that. Very low ticket, very easy to sell. Sell, you're gonna get a lot of sales. You just need to increase your average order value. And all right, lovely. This is a beach bag. Now this is not a need item. This is a want item, but I see it has a lot of potential. Um, and why that is, it's summer in the United States and, and Canada as well, but primarily United States, of course. Um, so I see this as an item that has a lot of potential. I'll show you the product in a moment um, because it's summer. It's very boho. Is that the word? Boho, boutique, uh, boutique, whatever. Which is a very large trend right now in the fashion industry. Okay. It has good margins. Okay. We can easily sell it for 30 bucks pretty much. It costs about $13 uh, plus a couple of dollars shipping. All right. So we got about a $15 margin. Um, this is an item that most likely women will only buy one of. All right. So you want to bundle it. Um... All right, and uh, who I would market this to is women that are over 25, all right, and I would then work my way back to 18 to 24, but um, 25 plus women in the United States, simple as that. Um, the interests I would choose would be beach, fashion magazines, boho, fashion models, fashion brands, holidays, boutique fashion brands, boutique fashion in general, uh, holidays, anything pertaining to the beach um, that that can be slightly related to this item because this is very heavily a, a beach related item. So if we have a look at the actual product itself, uh, it's pretty basic, but it really has that fashion element to it. Um, and it really caught my eye when I saw it. Why, go away. Anyway, so um, it's got a couple of different variants, all right, as we can sort of see here, we've got, um, so it's about, yeah, 15 bucks um, and it's free shipping. So we've got a good healthy margin in a good time of year with a good fashionable item and fashion items really do well. You're not gonna have any issues with sizing or whatever because it's just a strap with a bag. It's in a trending type of uh, niche at the moment being uh, boutique, all right? And you can try and upsell um, maybe another bag with it or some other beach related item is what I would do. Uh, for this one as well, in terms of the creative, just keep in mind, um, obviously again, videos do work well, but a lot of images, especially for these, work very well because, so if you could find a picture of, of a, a lady most likely just wearing the product or using it, well these are nice as well, like these these lifestyle type of uh, images uh, that do very well, especially on Instagram. Um, but, no, that was close. Anyway, try and find, if you can, uh, we can see it's got tons of reviews as well um, of, of a woman using the item or wearing it or something, okay? Um, especially if it was at the beach, that to me is what would work really well. But we can see here, we've got thousands of orders, thousands of reviews, very highly rated. You're not gonna have any, you're not gonna have 
you know, very few returns, easy to ship, so on and so forth, okay? And also very easy to brand. Pretty self-explanatory item. It's not, um, I haven't really seen it on Facebook at all. I couldn't find it when I had a search. Um, so go nuts, go nuts. This is definitely a great item to market, especially in the summer season. All right, and lastly, um, a number of you may have seen this one. This one's also very trending right now. Um, a great item, the inflatable baby ring. Um, uh, I again just found that it's uh, an item that I wanted to add to this list because it's a great need item. So what to do, it helps parents keep their children safe while they're swimming while also teaching them how to swim at the same time. So um, it actually has a harness. So the baby is sort of strapped into it very safely and securely of course. Um, teaches the baby how to swim. They can swim around the pool, have a good uh, fun, and uh, parents don't have to worry about their kids, you know, because they can't even really tilt it over. They won't have the capacity to. The way it's designed, it can't be tilted over. So it's very safe, very SID friendly. The product is perfect for summer again in the United States. So market it to countries where it is summer. Um, obviously, it can be sold anywhere, anyway, like anything, but it'll do much better in countries that the product reflects it, which will be summer. So US, United States and Canada, it's got multiple color variations, okay? It's got good profit margins. This is a higher ticket item. So it costs about 30 bucks with free shipping. So I'd be selling about 60 bucks. So you got a $30 margin, really nice healthy margin and sell some other baby items with it. Just to seriously sell some other baby items, get that average order value from 60, 70 bucks, you're laughing, all right? Um, so my recommendation for this product is to create a video that emphasizes on how the ba their baby will be safe, okay? So just make sure like again, introduce the product, show like, you know, the baby in a pool, maybe, you know, uh, just not in a safe manner, okay? I wouldn't emphasize on it being a, a terrible thing. Facebook will probably disapprove your ads actually, but just not safe. Uh, maybe some other baby um, swimming item that's not as safe as this and then introduce that, all right? So if you wanna make creative like that, that will work really well because it touches home you know, this is our product, this is what you don't want, this is what you do want, you can buy it from here, all right? Funnel them that way. Um, I would market it to women 25 up. Again, they're most likely the ones that are gonna buy it. Um, now, if it immediately works as well, try 18 to 24. Now, the reason is, is this is an exception uh, because a lot of 18 to 24 year old uh, women have kids. Now, obviously, their their kids, you know, for most people, they're their top priority. So. For them, they will have the money. Uh, they'll find the money to try and buy this item if they can, all right? So don't do it immediately, but definitely keep this one in mind because it, it has a huge potential for that age demographic as well, all right? Just as a little pro tip there. Um, the interest that I would market it to would be parents, you know, so like you can actually choose the demographics, parents, um, zero to six months, six to 12, so on and so forth, or seven to 12, whatever. Those are demographics that I would actually use this type of product that that would work well with. Uh, baby magazines, parenting magazines, baby TV shows, parenting TV shows, uh, Disney Channel, Nickelodeon, all of that. All right, just market to all of those channels and um, all of those interests and you'll be fine. Make it creative like that and you've got the best chance of success. Okay, guys, so let's have a look at the actual product to show you what I mean. So they've got a number of different variants. So this one does have a number of variants. Um, and what we can see here, Again, um, probably not those ones, but these are the ones. So see how it's got a really nice harness that's gonna keep them safe. Again, beautiful image for a thumbnail as well. I would just modify it just a little bit, but that's a great image for a thumbnail if you're wondering. We've got multiple color variations, okay? So for boys and, uh, boys and girls, absolutely perfect. We've also got this one as well. Um, which is another different item as well. It's also very SID friendly. So that's another um, variant idea as well. They're strapped into it um, through their their legs. So it's very safe as well. Um, now, uh, so those are a bit more expensive by the looks of it, but this one's about 30 bucks. So you can definitely get a lot of people buying this item. And what we can see is we've got a good amount of orders. We've got a good amount of reviews. Um, definitely an item that's trending up right now, especially because it's summer, all right? And it's gonna keep the baby safe, help solve a problem. Absolutely perfect item for you to market uh, as soon as possible, basically. And that concludes today's video on five unsaturated winning products for you in 2019 that can make you $100,000 
Go and market them right now. Get the slides down below so you can use that as reference. If you do want to find more unsaturated products, sales source is in the description down below as well. Don't forget as well to enter the competition for a 30-minute call with myself. Announced in The winner will be announced in the next video. To enter the competition, comment, crush it down below, like the video, subscribe, and share the video to enter the competition. You get a lot of value. And congratulations to today's winner from last video. Your name is in the description as well as in the pinned comments. Just contact me and we will schedule the 30-minute call together. Heaps of people have been getting the 30-minute call and they've been absolutely crushing it there on after. They absolutely love it and I absolutely love giving all this value out. Okay, guys. So I appreciate you watching today. It means a lot to me. I hope you have a lovely day. I hope you take care and goodbye.